Hello, it is Bethany from Beach and Plans, and today I'm going to be planning out Friday, June 5th, Saturday, June 6th, and Sunday, June 7th. So I want to do something a little bit different, and I feel like everything I do in this planner is different because it's still pretty new to me. Um, but what I want to do today is I want to see if I can get rid of all the green, which is funny because in another video I just said how much I like the green over the peach, but I just want to see if I can give this a total makeover. And I, I don't think I can get rid of the green inside the hexagon. I think that's, um, that, that would be a big ask. So instead I'm going to see how much I can get rid of and then also plan out, plan out the rest here. So I did um, leave myself a little bit of notes so I know what I am doing. I'm still getting used to the whole, um, sticky note situation. I'm used to like, I'm used to planning super, super ahead and um, not using stickies. So I'm gonna try this though and we'll see how it works. So far it's been fine because we can just get rid of them and start decorating. Um, I'm gonna try to use these washies to, um, to use instead of the green. So we'll see how far I get with that, but I'm excited. I think it'll be fun and just see what I can what I can cover up. We'll probably need some whiteout and plenty of washi and stickers, but let's go for it. So just going to go ahead and get started with, um, this is the neutral layers washi that comes in that layers pack of two from Erin Condren. So really excited to use this. Actually, this was back ordered on the Erin Condren website and I was able to find it on Amazon and it shipped within like three days. It was amazing. So, um, you know, if there's ever something you can't find on Erin Condren, you know, check Amazon. Sometimes it is there. So I'm just going to put some of this along the bottom of both of these pages and give it a little bit of a makeover there. Yeah, look at that. Way better. So, happy news. Something I'm putting on this weekend that I'm actually... It seems silly, but I'm super excited about it, is Goodwill is apparently now accepting donations again, which is fantastic. We have like so much stuff from all this decluttering we've been doing. So I'm really excited to get rid of that stuff and clear out our garage. There's been like a, a mountain of stuff in there that just really needs to go. And it's like our whole, like half of, a whole side of our garage is lined with like stuff that's been waiting to go to Goodwill for donation. And it is finally time for it to go. So it's been tempting to just, just throw it away but that's also super wasteful, I know. So I'm excited to be finally donating that this weekend. Also, the um, our recycling center is accepting uh, donations. We have a bunch of different just cardboard boxes and things that's been storing up. I actually call it Cardboard Mountain in our garage that um, we're excited to get rid of that too. Just like clear out because I've done a lot of decluttering, but we haven't been able to really, um, really enjoy it because of everything. I'm going to give this a little bit more room there. There we go. I actually had to rip it off, put another one. So, oh, well, <laughs> it is what it is. This wash is a little bit, I don't know. It's kind of flexible. If that makes sense, I'm getting used to it. Okay. Let me know. Do you ever get the piece of washi or the roll of washi where they're like, it is endless. There is no starter end to it. Like, uh, I feel like someone's pranking me right now because I literally cannot find the end to it. And I'm going along it like hard with my thumb. It is not. Ah, gotcha. There we go. All right, gonna attack this green with this like, I don't know, it's kind of like a plus little pattern there. So I think I'm okay if it shows a little bit because I know that I need that line to get it straight. If I white that out, it will be gone. So that's okay if that shows a little bit. I'm fine with that. Something else I am really, really excited about is um, on Monday next week, I have a hair appointment and I have not had one since um like I was due for one in April and then it got pushed off because I was sick and then it was pushed off because um I was on vacation and obviously uh COVID happened so it has been a really 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 long time I don't even remember when it last was probably I don't know maybe February 
January, like forever ago. Maybe not that long ago, but yeah, no, it must have been at least February, actually, when I think about it. All right, so that's a bunch of green gone. We're working through it. Um, let's see, next what I'm gonna do is for this piece of green here, I'm actually going to use this pink, which I really like, it's kind of like a marble pink, um, but it's too wide, so it would like cover too much. And so what I did, and I'm hoping this will work, is I took my paper cutter and I sliced it down. So now I have a piece that is, you know, about, about the right width. So I'm going to use that, but this one I am going to try whiting up because that would definitely show through on these. All right, all that is left are these little green dots and I'm gonna use these Erin Condren stickers. I think these will look really nice. They're kind of in the same color theme and they just add a little something. So at this point I can go ahead and start with a couple basic things. I'm going to put the hours in for Friday for work. I don't really have anything scheduled except for I'm podcasting on Saturday with my friend Heather. So I'm going to put that over here. Um, but yeah, I'm going to put in the hours for work and the weather and see what that's looking like from that point. Next, adding in some work appointments for Friday and then starting in on some to-dos, but I'm liking this so far. I really, really am. So yeah, hair appointment on Monday. What are you most looking forward to? Now things are opening up again. Hopefully they're opening near you as well. I know that for me, this is like, this is the thing. That's what I've been most looking forward to is getting my hair done and I cannot, cannot wait when my stylist um, texted me and said that we could make an appointment. Um, she was like, is, is, that, is that time gonna work for you? And I was like, um, yes, like you could have said three in the morning and I would have made it work. Like it did not matter, I was, I was getting in. So I'm pretty, pretty excited about that.
So that is everything I have for like scheduled stuff. The rest of what I want to put down are just to-do lists of things that I need to get done on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. The Saturday and Sunday are also what we call cleaning weekends, where on Saturday we clean the bedrooms and bathrooms, which is pretty much our whole upstairs. And then Sunday we do a power hour, which is just cleaning as much as we can, um, as fast as we can for one hour. And that will usually finish up the rest of the house when we have all four of us doing it. So I'm going to go ahead and add those things in. I kind of look forward to uh, cleaning weekends. I don't know what it is. I don't really... I was gonna say I don't like the cleaning, but maybe I do a little bit. The kids say I do, I don't know. I like the result of the cleaning more than I do uh, the process though, um, if, if I had to, I guess, admit to anything. So I think that's about like all the things I need to do at this point. I just want to fill in with a little bit more stickers because I mean, I feel like it. Yeah, stickers are not a necessity, but I just want to put a couple more things and then I think this is just about done. All right, so that is it. That is my weekend. I think it's looking really fun. And it was really nice to give some makeover over this because we started with this screen and now it looks totally different and I love it. So excited for the weekend. I hope you have an awesome weekend wherever you are. And I will see you next time.